guys welcome back to a new video yeah today is gonna be like a chill One. girl talk <laughs> yeah so many things to talk about like what do you want to know yeah like um i guess we're gonna start doing this more often so like comment down below um what what questions you have like what do you want us to talk about you know, just maybe a Q&A or something. Yeah. But now we're just gonna, like, talk random shit. <laughs> yeah. Nothing major. No. Nothing personal. Nothing political. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just stuff that happens. It's just gossip. <laughs> yeah. You know, girl alert. Hello. <laughs> yeah. Like, for instance, como esta mujer que ella estaba bailando, mm -hmm. Y, you know, she's a little bit shabby. Mm -hmm. And she was dancing just with like a little short and a crop top. Mm -hmm. Y todo su chicho como que, you know. <laughs> yeah, y alguien la grabó y la puso en Facebook, like making fun of her. Like, mm -hmm. why would you do that? You know? No, I know. We're like, we're, we like to be, in this channel, we like to be very body positive because as you can tell, she's very flaca. Like. I'm not flaca. Like, I need to lose some pounds, you know? <laughs> But there's no point, like, why would I make fun of, like, anyone? Mm -hmm. Because they fat or skinny or has chicho or a belly. Yeah, like, we yeah. understand the struggle. So. Yeah. I mean, the only thing I would say to you, like, hey, um, maybe you need to eat a little bit, he like, healthier. Mm -hmm. or, you know, it's not even, it's not even, like, the way you look is for your own health. Yeah, like, to, it, it gets to a certain point. Where like you, it, it's physically taking a toll on you, like health wise. But like, if you're healthy and you're big, like that's fine. Like. Yeah, but now everything is just cosmetic. Like, mm -hmm. Nobody has pimples now because of makeup. No, nobody is real. Like everything is fake. Yeah, I so, mean, I mean, what's the whole point? Like you know, you go out in the night, you get all you know makeup everywhere even in your yeah private part <laughs> what? yeah so what? you get all high and they're like you know super beautiful mm. you go out you have a great time you meet this guy or girl because guys also do it mm -hmm. and then yeah spend the night together next morning when everything is gone, like, what's gonna happen? <laughs> you wake up to the next to someone you don't even know. <laughs> it's like, no, I went out with, 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 a, with, a, pretty with, with a pretty girl last night. Who you? <laughs> yeah. So just be real and be you, like, you know? Yeah. I mean, but, like, makeup also, like... Because, like, there's a difference between, like, caking yourself with makeup. Because, like, we love makeup, yeah, obviously. We like, do, yeah. We're a makeup channel kind of <laughs> like makeup unboxing and all that stuff but yeah. like but like we don't like overdo it yeah and like no tea no shade like we're not throwing shade at anybody like no. if you if you feel like you have to wear a lot of makeup like do you that's fine yeah. but um like we like very natural looks like we like very light makeup like we don't mm -hmm. wear too much like it's very rarely when i wear makeup like i started wearing makeup two years ago when I was like, what's 18 minutes two? <laughs> when I was 16, okay. <laughs> I started wearing makeup when I was 16, and like still, I like rarely make. Like, what I'll do if I'm doing makeup like every day, it would be like eyeliner and lipstick. Like that's about it, and like maybe a little concealer to like, you know, yeah. cover. Yeah. yeah. Other than that, I mean, like. yeah, but I hate that like people posting stuff about other people, like mm -hmm. just talking bad things about them because they did, they down, like, yeah. no, let them leave, at least they're happy. Are yeah. you happy? Yeah, yes. if, you, if you feel the need to like post bad things about someone else, like, you're not happy, obviously. Yeah, or maybe you are just the way you are happy, yeah, but that's not the right way. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Anyways, moving on. <laughs> we, like, literally, like, we were bored, so we just, like, started recording yeah. and didn't really think about what we were going to talk about. We're just going to talk about stuff. Yeah. <laughs> talk about, talk about what? Like, um, well, I'm excited for Christmas. Yeah, me too. What'd you get me for Christmas? 
I'm not gonna tell you. Why would I tell you? <laughs> <laughs> it was not. It, it's worth the try. <laughs> <laughs> what are you getting me for Christmas? Um, topping that you desperately, desperately need. Um, what is that? A baby girl? <laughs> hey, you already have one right here. You're too big. You can spoil me. It's okay. I can. You can spoil me. It's okay. <laughs> no. Why don't you have a baby girl and just let me get her? <laughs> you can adopt. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I always think of that, but it's so hard. And so you can foster to adopt. I know, but this is the thing. Like I was, you know, looking into that, and then. I don't know where you live, how it is, and I'm an older people, but here mm -hmm. in this city, mm -hmm. <laughs> when I went, they say that they give you a child, and then you have to foster them like for two years, and then for you to be able to adopt them, or her, or him, um, you need to foster them first, and then if the family member, like any family member, comes alone, like the day before the two years mm -hmm. and they want the, the the girl or the boy and they are suitable for them they're gonna give it to them so then you're gonna love that child for two years and then like for 23 months and then on the 24 month some random family member is gonna come and take it away from you yeah i mean you can just straight up adopt them you, you if that? you are a foster you you're not supposed to adopt them and you know no i mean but like why don't you like adopt just, we like, need money huh we need money it costs a lot of money oh yeah well then foster to adopt it's like it, like like a family member like adopting them before like if you get let's say get if not a baby do you want a baby baby yeah you want oh you want because i want to teach that baby like my ways mm. i don't want like like a big you know i mean you know yeah yeah don't take it in the wrong way but i yeah. just want a baby yeah. i mean i want to have the entire yeah. you know experience with a baby girl oh <laughs> i mean just try it out like like if if a family member like does come by like you can still be like asked to be in her life Oh, yeah. And like it's very rare, cause like if they if they're in the foster system, like, like usually it's cause either like it's very rare that a family member comes and claims. I them. mean, I saw one case that happened like that, mm -hmm. and then one of the aunts of the kid came along and she said, "Oh, I wanted it," and then you know they give it to the aunt. Um, well, but it's very rare that that happens. So just yeah. give it a try. If it if it goes wrong, you're like. Can you do? Yeah, not have it myself. <laughs> yeah, I have a child myself. <laughs> Hell no. Then another boy is going to Yeah, she has three boys already. Yeah, so. I don't want a fourth one. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so just a dog. Like, just do it. Maybe. And, like, off the record, you, you get paid for like, fostering the child. <laughs> So like another, another job. Money. Yeah. The government gives you money to sustain that child. Yeah, they do though. Yeah. Most of the people do it for that reason, but yeah, I don't want to do it for yeah. that reason. Yeah. You want to do it just because you want to spoil her. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, because then you're gonna, you're gonna, you're not gonna love me. I mean, like, get out of here. I have my own girl. <laughs> no, you still need to spoil me. Like, like the baby is the one that you get to like, like dress up and be cute and whatever but like with me you could have real talks like girls talk <laughs> <laughs> yeah you can't be like oh so what boy do you like to like a one-year-old girl <laughs> why not i mean like hey do you have a boyfriend <laughs> <laughs> okay no but i like i like just do it because i also like when I'm thinking about like what I'm gonna do in five years or whatever, I like also think like I wanna adopt a child and like I wanna adopt a baby and then I also wanna adopt like a big kid because like with the baby like you said like you, you could teach him the ways and whatever ways that you yeah and like prevent them from having a bad life. 
but I want like also like I find it very like whole like I don't know like heartfelt whatever whatever the word is um like you get adopting like an older kid mm -hmm. because you get to make a change in their life you get to like yeah. like they have a really bad life like maybe they had like a really bad past or whatever like with their previous family or forever for whatever reason they are in the foster care mm -hmm. and then you get to like change change that. their life like make them happy like give them all the things they didn't have before and i i, I find that like i want to have like a baby girl and then an older boy yeah. or like vice versa like something like that yeah. that's nice and then have like one one of my own because <laughs> I don't want to go through the like the the birthing experience because you should. that hurts. <laughs> but it's amazing though. <laughs> it is. Yeah, you I get to, you hurts, get you get free <laughs> you get free seats on the bus. <laughs> it's amazing just to have like someone else inside you that you can feel the little tiny body for nine months inside you moving everything. It's amazing. It's you know uncomfortable, mm -hmm. but it's amazing. It's so oh so I went down. Can this you imagine like loving someone so freaking much that you don't even know how how it's gonna look, how mm -hmm. what color, anything. You don't know anything about this little person inside here, but you are dying <laughs> for that little person. You know. Yeah. yeah. I mean, like I recently went down this rabbit hole. In, on YouTube where like I was just watching well <laughs> I was just watching like a normal house vlog and then the family had like was gonna have a baby so like they were showing around in the nursery and then and then I started watching like oh what's in my hospital bag and like oh, oh yeah. what's what uh, the like what to expect for my child and then boom I'm in labor vlogs and, and the people are like screaming and I'm like hold on what <laughs> <laughs> How did I get here? <laughs> and then it's like, oh, um, day after birth, and like I was, I was just like, I was so confused. I was like, why am I here? Yeah. But like, I, like they were interesting. I was like, cool. And like, I don't know. And now I'm like, should I get an epidural? Should I not? Like, it's painful either way. <laughs> Cause like, like I want to get an epidural because when the pushing happens, it's gonna hurt. No. And like the contractions are gonna hurt, but at the same time I'm terrified of the needle going in my back because <laughs> yeah. that's gonna hurt. <laughs> so I don't know. Can't they just like put me to sleep, <laughs> get a C-section? But there's that no you don't you don't go to sleep with C-section. They just you know numb your like bottom part and that's it. You, you still are, get an epidural. <laughs> yeah, you are awake. <laughs> oh my god! No, thank you. I'm terrified of like tearing. Uh uh. Like, I'm terrified. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I, I'm, I might not have a child because I'm terrified of pain, just in general. Like, like, I have, like, me myself, I have a high pain tolerance. Like, I'll be in pain and, like, you won't even notice unless I, like, tell you. Because, like, I don't, I'm, I'm not the type of person to be like, ah, it hurts! <laughs> like, I'm not like that. But, <laughs> but I'll still be, like, I'll be suffering on the inside. I'm like, this is fine. I'm fine. <laughs> but in reality, I'm dying. Yeah. So I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm afraid that that's how it's going to be in the doctor. And the doctor's like, oh, so how are you? I'm like, I'm fine. fine. I'm, I'm fine. And, and, and in reality, I'm dying inside. And it might be because something is wrong. <laughs> so, like, I don't know. I'm scared. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> But like, definitely foster. <laughs> Just do it. I mean, you know what I love to do? I would love to have like a lot of money mm -hmm. and just buy like a like a big house and like hire people, like good people, mm -hmm. like good, good, super good, hard people, mm -hmm. and you know, like make an orphanage basically. Yeah, some, but not like a you know like a sad one, you know, a happy place. Yeah. For them to be like big kids, mm -hmm. little kids, babies, you know. We should do that at some point in our life. Yeah. I'm gonna write that on my bucket list. Like, I always have that in my mind. Like, if I would have money, I would buy, you know, like a big house 
and hire people like hire someone to help me mm-hmm. you know to have kids not like a daycare no kids that you know that are in foster foster system and have them live there give them a good life mm-hmm. and make them happy until, yeah, until they get adopted or something yeah or until they're ready to move on like work or yeah. you know mm-hmm. yeah that's that would nice. Be nice. Yeah. I mean, we could start really such a dream and like start saving money. Yeah. yeah. So, like, if you want to help, <laughs> if you want to help, you know, subscribe, like, yeah, you should. Because <laughs> that's one of like our goal, like, you know, help yeah. the kids. Yeah. Like, I, I've always wanted to adopt or foster. I want to foster animals too. You should do that in the same building, foster animals. <laughs> no. <laughs> It'll make the kids happy. <laughs> well, they would teach them how to take care of them. Yeah, be responsible, yeah. 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 That's good. So there you go. Like <laughs> Pets and, 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 and kids, orphanage, foster home, whatever. <laughs> You're the worst. And we don't even have to, like, and, like we could employ people who are unemployed like it could be like oh wow it could be like a whole thing <laughs> it's like yeah. we're helping everybody the people who work there are people we help the, the people who live there are kids we help the animals also like wow <laughs> yeah i mean and the kids who turn 18 or you know and they yeah and they work, yeah they're looking for a job they could work there too, and you know? you know people can help them like find work in another place like you know have like everything we should start a gofundme place. page for that Oh, well. GoFundMe page. Mm. And how do you get that? It's like stuff? okay, it's like a website where people post like, like let's say like we have like this dream, right? So we write, hey, we want to start a foster home, an orphanage home, whatever. And then we need this amount of money. Can you help us raise that money? And then people will donate like money to like start that. Okay. Yeah. Have any of you guys done any of that? If you have. <sighs> Yeah, but like, we should totally do yeah, that. Yes, no. Yeah. We should. We're gonna find more. <laughs> After <laughs> this, that's what we're gonna do. You know, you should totally go check it out. Link in the description. <laughs> maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Yeah. Find out. Okay. So far, it's been very, <laughs> it's been very like dreams and, and hopeful. <laughs> Gossip, no tea, no tea, yeah. no shade. <laughs> I mean, do you have any gossip? Not gossip, but like James Charles just released a uh, make everything really challenge. again, like again, <laughs> and then Christmas again, <laughs> and then Christmas. It's a collaboration with Morphe and like. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> no, but seriously, um, like all his colors are like like pure pigment. It's not like, like not like the sciencey thing where they like mix the color and then with something else to make it eyeshadow. Mm-hmm. Like the actual color is the eyeshadow, so like your your eyes get like taint like what you call it. Whatever. Tinted. Huh. <laughs> like your your eyes get tinted. Um. So like it stays like let's say you put pink on and like then it stays pink. For how long? Like for a little bit, not for too long. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's like it's like it's like. So it's a waste of money then. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it's um like very pigmented. He, he like. He wanted uh, his bright colors to be like super pigmented, cause like mm-hmm. let's say like hot pink, like it might be super pigmented on the on the little plate thing, but then when you put it on your eye, it like kind of dulls down. Oh. So he wanted uh, his, his like the shadows that the color from the thing is also the color you get when you apply it. Okay. So, um, but then this girl like and on his release video he was like oh all the colors. All the like super bright colors are like the actual pigment um so like you know because it's super pigmented and whatever and then this girl um posted a video where she was like oh he never told us that it was gonna stain our eyes and blah 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 blah, blah. like 
what kind of makeup artist um does that like what kind of like psycho person like lets people like um stain their eyes blah 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 blah, blah. and then everybody even like a bunch of famous people were like girl like <laughs> Pure pigment stains, reds, pinks, and and all these colors stain. Like everybody was getting on her. Like, girl, you obviously don't know makeup because pure pigment stains. And then it was so funny. And then she was like, no, it's because of this. Blah 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 blah. He never said anything. And then James Charles literally put in a clip of him being like, um, no, I said pure pigment and logically pure pigment stains. So funny. <laughs> it's like some people like want to like like get drama so bad to like mm -hmm. get attention and whatever that they'll post anything yeah. without without checking facts first. It was like it was funny. Yeah. I felt bad for her though. Because like obviously like she didn't know much, maybe, I don't know. Like I mean, maybe you should get it if you like. Yeah, I'm probably gonna get it. If I don't get it for Christmas, I'm getting it myself. <laughs> But it's like a hundred and something for like the full set for like the palette and then all the all the brushes. Mm -hmm. But like, you know what I really want? Mm. Da, um, I forgot the name. Dyson, Dyson, Dyson. The new hair dryer mm -hmm. that comes like with five different things or six. Mm -hmm. You should Google it. It's so good. Dyson hair dryer, mm -hmm. hair blower, something like that. I I always want the hair blower that's like a circle thing. It's like you can put your hand through. It's like that. Cause you wanna, cause you yeah. Just, you just <laughs> Almost like that. This is a neon thing. You should. It's so cool. I like it. Mm -hmm. but you know how much is it? For the full. Four hundred. For the full set, like eight things, it's like seven hundred and something. Oh my like, god. What? <laughs> really? Save up. <laughs> <laughs> nah, not even say. Up. Why am I gonna spend seven hundred on a hair thing? Yeah. I mean, I would for my my hair, but damn it, that's too much. You could open a, a salon with that seven hundred. <laughs> <laughs> nah, anyway, like I I would buy I would spend it but in products, you know, mm -hmm. shampoo, conditioner, blah blah blah, mm -hmm. oils, yeah, all that kind of thing. But in that only that no, that's too much. For me. Yeah. It is, honestly. Yeah. I'm not there yet. We're not there yet. No. <laughs> and I'm sick, so don't mind my voice. <laughs> um, who else released a good makeup palette? <clears throat> Ooh, um, Jeffree Star. Do you follow Jeffree Star? No. Mm. He used to be like, uh, like a punk, a pop rock singer. Mm -hmm. Um. And then he became like a makeup artist and like before before the whole Shane Dawson series have, did you see no you didn't see it obviously mm -hmm. but like you should totally watch it but um like before everybody hated him because he he was first like he first became very famous on MySpace because he was like one of, like one of the few guys on MySpace that actually did makeup and then, so like he got very famous there, and then he started. Um, he got, uh, he got con uh, like signed by um, Convict Studios. Mm -hmm. um, and then like during his like MySpace days, like he was very angry and very um, like very verbal, mm -hmm. but not in the, like he was like calling people like bad names and all that stuff. Um, but it was because, like, everybody was like, oh, you're gay, blah, 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 blah. Um. So, so what if he's gay? Yeah, like, yeah. I don't know. But it was, like, in 2006, so, like, that time not everybody was, like, so open-minded. Mm -hmm. But, like, still. And then, like, he would say, like, bad things as, like, um, like, a way to, like, reflect, like, if I'm mean, like, it's not hurting me. Like, mm -hmm. like, that's what he thought. But, um... But then after like the Shane Dawson thing and where it, it like it gave him like a platform to like talk about it. Mm -hmm. Like everybody loves him now. I loved him before, like I loved his music, I love like him in general. But um but yeah, like he now like owns his own makeup company. Um That's so good. Yeah, and like he's he also he's a shipping company, like he has a shipping company as well where he ships 
other people's merch and makeup and stuff. So like he literally started from living in like a one bedroom apartment to like having a mansion, multi wow. like Lamborghini, like three Lamborghinis, a bunch of cars, like six dogs, wow. his own like big company, like that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> I, me, please. <laughs> like, he bought everybody from his family a house. Like. That's nice. Yeah. Yeah, that's actually nice. Because some people, because they have money, they just forget about mm -hmm. it. No, he helps his family. He helps his boyfriend's family. Like, it's mm -hmm. nice. It is. And, like, he, he, he donates a lot. And he's always coming up with new makeup. It, he always has no makeup. I mean, makeup is everything now. Yeah. Like, what the heck? I mean, like, I don't mind because I like makeup. <laughs> I mean, I like it too, but damn it. Yeah. It's everything. <laughs> I mean, no, now it's the slime, slime videos. <laughs> ASMR slime videos. <laughs> and like, You have to do some slime video too. Yeah. Oh, no, there's this floral thing now. The, you know 